We blame the devil for all kind of things. The devil is bad. Okay, I understand that. But the poor devil get blamed for everything under the sun. <laughs> yes. Devil is bad, I admit. But I'm telling you something. Your enemy, my enemy, more than you realize is not the devil. It is our own self-centeredness. Yes. And Jesus came not only to save me from my sin and hell, but during my life in this pilgrimage to set me free from my own self-centeredness. The church is so totally disobedient in picking up the cross and willing to lay down their life like Amy Carmichael Judson and thousands who marched the way of the cross and were martyred instead of committing our life for sacrifice and death we blame the devil for the whole world going to hell my brother my sister I am not here to put you on a guilt trip intimidate you get something out of you and run to the next place that's not my purpose here but I want to ask you one simple question when you heard over 100,000 people died in Rwanda in a few days time when you heard in a week over 100,000 swept away from Bangladesh into the oceans and millions left homeless where were you what happened to you the following day did your son ask you mama why are you not eating today after three days your son said daddy it seems that you are not eating any food what happened are you sick can you say my son you remember we watched the news and saw what happened yes daddy son I'm so broken hearted over the millions that are perishing that I decided to fast and pray and stand in the gap on the behalf of a world that is going to hell and forever without Jesus. That's the only reason. When was the last time you as a family sat down and said, let's talk about it? Half of the world go to bed with empty stomach and naked bodies. Some 80,000 die every day and slip into hell. You and your wife and kids and as a family, when was the last time you made a pack, a discussion and say, we will live as strangers and pilgrims on this earth with sacrifice and commitment and tears and fasting and touch the lost world with our lifestyle and commitment.